Clang on 42 for six, and this is the seventh over of play. As he comes to the crease, requiring a little bit of a score to get his team back on the variety here. He tests the wicket a little bit, just checking it out there with his bat, feeling for the firmness, brushing aside any debris. Again, coming in with no shoes, a very dangerous tactic here. And he will immediately face the bowling of a small boy coming down the hill from the trapeze end. And somebody else has uh, got a can of lager and a cigarette. Uh, lovely stuff there as he tucks up, coming down the wicket. True vintage shot there, blocking out the bad ones. He must be terrified by this small boy approaching, storming down the hill from the trapeze end. And in he comes one more time. Right arm over the wicket. He's up and he bowls. It's a full pitch delivery. He's no good. He's being cleaned by his own ball there. Being cleared and bowled. And he goes for a duck. Mr. Oh, Alistair uh, Campbell goes for a duck. And the score moves on to 42 for oh, 7. And it's been asked for a review. Alistair, can we please come and have a word with you? you you're an honest man. You, you never tell lies or skew the truth. I, I drove it into the turf. It bounced up and caught it. It always looks like a catch, but it actually went straight into the ground. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to go to the audience for the uh, fourth re review uh, <laughs> procedure. Uh, if we believe that Mr. Alistair Campbell hit the ball into the ground before it was caught, could you please cheer now? If we believe that he was clean caught by the small boy from the trapeze end, please cheer now. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, the judge, jury and court of the crowd at the Wilderness MC Cricket Down for Cricket People Fraternity Association have declared you out by a unanimous decision. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Alistair Campbell has been caught.